just last night, I got this release from um, the Fulani Nationality Movement saying that God has given them this land, Nigeria, and that they have the right to live anywhere and until the colony is established, there will be no rest in Nigeria. And they are calling on all Fulanese across West Africa to come to Nigeria with arms for this holy war. When a prophet speaks, listen. Please listen. This was a communique that came on the thought. I never saw it. But God spoke to me. This came last night. Well articulated. In fact, I heard them say that the Katu colony is the only solution to the crisis. Whether the federal government or state government accept or not, we have asked all Fulani Hatsmen all over West Africa to move to Nigeria and penetrate every corner for the upcoming jihad. Is here. It's on the net. It's on the net. I saw it coming. 1992. I declared it 2015. I saw it coming. Lift up your two hands. Ask the Lord. For the sake of the elect, scatter this gang up. Put them to silence. Let Nigeria have rest. Pray this prayer from the depth of your heart. No! No to bloodshed in Nigeria. Silence these enemies of peace and silence them forever. De lo prek tenero dialeta. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' precious name. They said that the killings in Benway of Thief is well deserved. They stopped us from overrunning Nigeria in 1804, which is our God-given land. We are out on a revenge. Did you hear that? That's how much the devil hates the peace in Nigeria. But by your prayers and the prayers of the saints, the end has come to this uprising. You reign, you ancient Zion's king, Kadosh, Kadosh, you are mighty on the throne.